Oh, there's a new patch out. They revised it. So there's been a revision to the tanks experimental patch. And it looks like there's some other changes as well. So let's go through them really quick. Mercy, allies can be resurrected now and have their respawn timer paused. So the bug was this was if you went for the res on Mercy and you started resing, it wouldn't pause their timer. So like you would just spawn back while they're still resing, you lose the ult. And that was kind of ass. So Mencha turrets now no longer heal full health targets. Turrets healing now grants ultimate charge. Beautiful. Uh, Genji, Genji no longer loses the attack speed buff when the sheathing animation is interrupted. Okay. Tanked uh, reduction. All right, this is actually this is actually huge. Sorry, I'm gonna outer a little bit on this. Lemon Kiwi actually came to me and, and, and asked about this and wanted to have a little bit of a conversation. And this is actually something we we, we heavily talked about was uh, the 50 to 25 percent and also giving more ultimate charge uh, because honestly the idea of the patch was really good um, and surviving longer was really really cool. But feeling like you have a wet noodle and you have no response and you'll never get an ultimate because like. When we six stacked um, with like Emong, J, myself, um, ML, actually did ML? No, ML didn't play with us. Um, so, like it was we basically had a full stack. Um, EVA and, and, and Somnus, I forget where our last one was. Um, but yeah, we basically spawn camp teams in the experimental when we were trying it out. And like these, like, you know, they're like normal players, you know, like some of them were actually GM, but like, you know, there was like a normal like plat team or a diamond team that was sniping us. And, uh, like, we spawn camp them a few times, and I don't think they built a single ult. Their tanks never built ults. So, like, that should never happen. Um, so, this ultimate charge thing, I, I think this is a massive change. Pile driver, damage increased from 50 to 100. What? Okay. Uh, halt, duration increased from 1.5 to 2.5 seconds. That's actually big, because the halt, the kidnap thing was actually kind of cool, but it felt like it wasn't long enough to be inf impactful, so that's awesome. Range increased by 30% for the supercharger. Health increased from 200 to 400. Ultimate cost reduced by 30%. So basically, that's gets, she gets her slow. So basically, if you don't remember what the Arisa one was, her supercharger uh, slowed everybody in the area down. Basically, it's a lot tankier now, and it can actually be a useful ultimate. Winston, ammo increased from 100 to 150. Damage increased from 50 to 75. Whoa, that's actually... Whoa, okay. Um... That's really actually interesting. So this was actually something I talked about um, with Lemon Kiwi, was how Winston literally built ult faster by punching than by using his left click, and how that was felt terrible. Um, so I that, I wonder if that was something they came up with was you know to make the left click more impactful, and the jump change is actually kind of crazy. That actually, if that combos with Primal, Primal actually would be kind of strong. Roadhog. Um, range of allied buffs increased by 100%. Chain hook now slows the target hook target by 40% for two seconds. So if you hook them, pull them in, shoot, they literally can't get away for a couple seconds. Whoa, that's actually kind of wild. That's actually that's actually kind of a cool cool change. Holy shit! Viva micro missiles cooldown decrease from eight to six seconds. Wait, oh, you guys can't see? Oh, my bad. Um, sorry, I was on the I was on the wrong screen. Anyways, micro missiles decrease from eight seconds to six seconds. Um, that's actually I remember it used to be like six seconds, and it was actually like kind of strong. I'll go through it really really quick just because you guys maybe didn't see it because my camera was messed up. Pile driver increased from fifty to one hundred. Uh, Tolt one point five to two point five. Uh, supercharger changes. Winston changes are actually pretty massive. Roadhog change. The hook is actually huge. Slowed target by 40% for two seconds. Now Sigma. Kinetic Grasp no longer grants crowd control immunity. I know the last one did that. I must have forgot. All right. So there's some stuff changes to the damage and stuff as well. So I'll go those really fast. Um, concussive. Con Hello? Vera, concussive blast. Enemies are no longer immune to con additional con concussive blast knockbacks when hit by concussive blast okay so now you can double boot people off the map that's terrible um we're gonna make it widow's kiss full charge time for scope shots reduced from 0.9 to 0.7 and reduced from 30 to 35 to 30 number of active venom mines reduced from 3 to 1 cooldown increase from 10 to 15 damage increase from 10 to 15 venom mine debuff duration increase from 3 to 5 seconds projectile speed decreased 30 percent what um 
Infrared reduce from 15 to 10 seconds. What the fuck is this widow change? Uh, Soldier 76, cooldown reduced from 8 to 6 seconds. I thought that was in the last one. Or was it only... Couldn't do self-damage. I don't know. Bastion ammo reduced from 100 to 60. Yeah, honestly, Bastion left click was was absurd. I I literally walked around just holding left click. It was on, and I never stopped shooting. It was wild. Uh, now Mercy. Mercy actually needed some some little bit of changes, and I I think this is actually pretty good. Cooldown decreased from 20 to 17 seconds on Valkyrie. Flying movement speed increased by 30 percent. So basically, I think it should feel like old Valkyrie. Um, Guardian Angel movement speed increased by 25 percent. So I think it's back to normal. Resurrect cast time decreased from 1.75 to 1.5 seconds. Ultimate cost reduced by 15%. I think that this actually fixed a lot of the major problems with this patch. Now, I do think that some of the DPS ones are just out of left field. Like, this kind of feels like just making a change to making a change. And I don't think double concussive blast is, is in any sense a good idea. Um, And I'll show you why. But I would assume. Clearing the area. Something like that is a little ridiculous. Kill confirmed. The bot is literally standing right here and gets booped off the map. And that was with like that was with me kind of missing it too. Takes heavy cooldown investment at least. Yeah, but it, that won't matter that really doesn't matter though. Cooldown investments are like that secure major kills like that are extremely effective. I literally did it too strong. One more time. One more time. Get back. There you go. Right on time. The bot is literally hugging the fing wall. I can boop him out of the wall and then off the map. Regardless though, like this is just kind of ridiculous. Back. One. Please start to move back. Take all year. Take all year. Why don't you? Why don't you? <sighs> the idea, though, on maps that have like any type of like off the map boopage. Move back. Any map that has off the map boopage like that, imagine the fucking control you can have. That is absolutely stupid. I don't care what anyone says. They they originally put that on there as a fail safe because it felt probably too or was going to be too strong, and then they took it off because everyone else is getting buffed. I don't know about that one. That change is a little questionable. Regardless, though, I think they actually tackled a lot of the problems that uh, it was having. So, good update. Actually, Pin should one-shot again, actually. Now that I think about it. Hold on. Really quick. Right, let me test that, actually, really, really quick. Oh, yeah. That's good. That works. That's good. Honestly, a lot of the problems just got fixed. Right there. Draw Machine, these are the primer nine months, by the way. Appreciate it, dude. Li Zhang is going to be horrible with the double boop. Oh, yeah. Don't even don't even go near Li Zhang, uh, like, bridges and stuff. You'd have to run D.Va. The D.Va has to eat one of the boops. Well, that's a good update. That's good. That, uh, that fixed a lot of the problems with the experimental, so...